Welcome back. It's great to have you with us for this exciting conclusion of our very special five-part Sky High Auctions mini-series on how to boost your online auction profits by 200% or more. Last time we looked at different ways of increasing your profit margins and today we'll be finishing up by finding out how to increase the number of transactions that you can make per customer. Before discussing strategies for this technique, I just want to emphasize how important this part of the profit equation is. When I said the fifth part of this five-part course was going to be exciting, I wasn't exaggerating. You see, so many merchants on eBay sell to their customers one time and have no strategy for building relationships and receiving repeat purchases from their customers. They completely overlook one of the fundamentals of a successful business, repeat customers. You work so hard to get each customer. Doesn't it make sense that you should try to hold on to them and encourage them to come back? Building a repeat customer base is absolutely essential to a successful online business and yet it's hardly ever discussed in any of the eBay books or guides I've read. So today I'm very pleased to be able to give you some of the ways you can get customers coming back to your store time and time again. Stick to a limited number of niche markets. Selling in just one niche market is best. The reason for this is that if you sell in just one market, for instance, fitness equipment, then you'll have much higher chance that your customers will buy from you again and again. They are clearly interested in that area, and it's much easier for you to sell a sports ball to someone who's already bought an exercycle than someone who has bought something completely unrelated. You'll also find it easier to source products as you'll need to purchase more items through the same suppliers. So, you'll get a chance to build good relationships and get better prices. In your product descriptions, always include the phrase, check out my other listings. I've got some great deals on related product 1, related product 2, related product 3, and more. That way, people will be encouraged to look at your other items for sale. They may be even more interested in some of these than the original item they were searching for. Always include a product catalog and or limited time discount coupons with your items when you ship them out. This will help sell other products in your range. You might even want to include a coupon so the buyer can purchase another of the same product at a discount for their friends. Provide excellent, fast, and efficient customer service and delivery. The better your service, the higher your feedback ratio on eBay, and the more people will return to buy from you again. Set up your own website and encourage visitors to bookmark your website. Set up a newsletter on your website so that you can email subscribers your latest specials, new shipments, and so forth. If you sell seasonal products such as Valentine's Day gifts, consider emailing your customers who purchased gifts last year with your offers for this year. Well, that's it folks. I really hope that you've enjoyed our five-part video series on how to boost your online auction profits by 200% or more. The great news is that this is only the tip of the iceberg. We've created more than 55 step-by-step -step video lessons, written versions of each lesson, interviews with numerous eBay power sellers, and a whole lot more for the full Sky High Auctions course. You'll learn everything you need to know to make a killer living from online auctions. Remember, Sky High Auctions launches 11 a.m. Eastern Time, the 6th of March, 2008. Until then, please feel free to email me all of your questions. I am a real person and I am here to help. My direct email is jimmy at skyhighauctions.com. Sky High Auctions will make a lot of people a lot of money over the course of the coming year and beyond. So keep your eyes peeled for these next few weeks and I'll be sharing with you very soon what we've been secretly working on for the past 18 months. I'll be in touch again soon. Bye.